Singapore, the Global Spotlight will be on Singapore next week as it hosts what would be a historic summit between US President Donald Trump and North leader Kim Jong-un. More than 2,500 people from local and international media are expected to cover the event here, according to the number of registrations received by the Ministry of Communications and Information as of Tuesday, June 5. Journalists will work from the International Media Center which is being set up at the F1 pit building in the Marina Bay area. There will be several sections at the International Media Center, including a broadcast center operated by MediaCorp which is the host broadcaster for the June 12 summit. Work is underway to get the International Media Center ready. There will be about 2,000 workstations and 50 media booths, and journalists will get access to free high-speed wireless internet access. The F1 pit building. Other facilities include a live feed distribution system, as well as locations for broadcasters to file live reports as the event progresses. These services are, however, available for booking only on a first-come first-served basis and subject to fees set by MediaCorp. The International Media Center will open round the clock from 10 a.m. on June 10 to 10 p.m. on June 13. MediaCorp CEO Tam Loki Keng said the company is committed to delivering the best possible facilities and services to journalists covering the event. To this end, we are making significant investments in manpower and technical expertise and infrastructure. MediaCorp is tremendously proud to be broadcasting what is undoubtedly a historic event that will resonate across the world as a momentous step towards world peace. There has been no confirmation of the venue for the summit, but Shangri-La Hotel and the Capella have been touted as possible locations. The areas around both hotels have been gazetted as special event areas for the Trump-Kim summit.